Hey everyone, yet another <laughs> last minute uh, teardown because I just don't want my streak to end. I've been doing a teardown every day for the past um, four, five days. So I'm going to make it happen at 11 23 p.m. Let's get started. Uh, this is for a brand called Magic Mind. I. I bought this a couple of times already. I use it for focus, right? And so this is a Labor Day uh, promo. So I guess it's an extended Labor Day, which I don't um, think brands should do. Extended uh, promos. But anyway, I don't know. The, the cut, the, let's add some new ones there. If a brand tells you beforehand that they're going to end at a specific date. For example, hey, Labor Day sale. This year's Labor Day, September 5th, right? Uh, if they say, hey, we're starting a Labor Day sale, it ends on September 8th. And they email me on, you know, they tell me last day, September 8th. You know, that's, that's cool. But if you tell me, hey, we have a Labor Day sale going on only on September 5th, only today, then they're they're creating the sense of urgency, and then come September sixth, they go surprise, <laughs> and sale extended. Nah, that's not cool. You know, it's just you're you're lying, and it just it's not a cool look. It, it you look desperate, if anything else, which nobody likes. Cool. So uh, disclaimer, like always, uh, this the criteria that I use. You can see here on the right hand side. Design, copy, CTA, branding, and unsubscribe compliance type of thing. Um, all external factors that everyone can see. I can see online type of thing. Uh, no internal anything. No metrics. I have no access to them. I don't work for these companies. And no assumptions whatsoever on whether any specific email is successful or not revenue-wise or any metrics whatsoever. Cool. And now, now we have that out of the way. Let's get to it. Magic Mind. Um, let's see. So uh, we're going to go look at the design. I like their collars. I love collars. I have the logo there. 100% satisfaction. Or your money back. Also, the whole thing is an image. Okay. I like that I see the um, the product there in action. Just It's a cute little bottle like this. So within 30 days, oh, so this is all image. I'm surprised. Okay. Uh, within 30 days of your first purchase, if you're not 100% satisfied, okay. First, try Magic Mind, Motivation for Book 13. This makes me sad in the sense that, um, okay, so we do have some plain to out. No way, it's all images. All right. Um, cool. So design-wise, this is a beautiful email. I love all the colors. It's just designed so well in terms of the way it looks. I love it. Um, I love this footer. It's clean. Uh, it has. It, it just tells me what I need to know. But learn more about the product. Testimonials connect. Um, this tells me that they know their their audience because they're answering the questions that are most frequently asked right because magic mind is not is a new tropic i think that's how you pronounce it but essentially they're um it's fairly new in the sense that it's kind of like a a brain you're kind of gaming your brain with natural mental brain enhancing things <laughs> oh my bad i'm so terrible at this um explaining this thing but anyway i think this is a great footer love it i'm a big fan of footers that are clean that have a purpose that they just didn't put everything in there because they could have easily put home and recipes and all these things um they know their audience i don't know if the footers are the same for every other email they send out but for a campaign email that's telling me to give it a try, it's a Labor Day sale. They give me enough to go on with. Learn more about the product, right? What people have been saying, testimonials, and to connect with them. 
now I want to know where it goes, but I want to connect. Oh, it's to their Instagram. Interesting. So maybe they do a lot. Of, um, they talk to their people through Instagram. That's cool, right? If you know your audience, you go there, right? So now I like that the the hero text, right? It's big. I can tell that's what they're telling me. Uh, I like that they put the most important stuff there. We're just thirty dollars off. That's a big deal. That's right there, right? It's a banner. They have a picture of their product. A little so-so on the center line. You know how I feel about this. If you've seen it before, um, the CTA button color. I don't know if it pop- does it pop up enough. Perhaps, maybe, right? Um, Motivation and focus guaranteed. Okay. Um, I wonder what would happen. You know what? I didn't. Let me see if I could do that. Motivation and focus guaranteed. It was 655 reviews. Okay. This thing again, the center line. If you have anything more than three, four lines, left align this baby, right? I know it's a design thing. And also... It's, it's, it makes me sad. Let me, if I could, if I could go in, I think I could go into settings, right? And then I believe, is it here where I can turn off the images? I think it's here. Where can I find that? I want to see if they have, the reason why I'm doing this is because it's all images. And I want to um, see if they have alt texts on it. How do you design? Um, wait, there we go. There we go. So let's save that and then continue. And then we're going to just go back to this. See? If I had my images closed, all I would see is Magic Mind. Try, try, try it. Boom. Right? It's, I mean, not a lot of people do this, right? I don't do it. Um, but you, recently I have been just to see what people have on their alt texts. But well, you see here that they don't have it. So I would have missed all that copy that they worked hard to put together. And, you know, if any of their customers um, have a kind of disability that use um, screen readers, for example, or do they call it voiceovers, right? Um, and we're never read any of the copy because all they have is this. Try ma- all they're going to hear is Magic Mind. Try Magic Mind today. Try Magic Mind today. Magic Mind. Learn more. Testimonials. Connect. Instagram. Twitter. Unsubscribe. Yay. Um, so let's turn this on again. So you see, um, I wasn't expecting that, actually. It's my first time going through this with you. Um, this is, and they're offering something really good. It's third note. They, the person never heard about the $30 off. The hundred percent satisfaction or your money back guarantee within thirty days. Try you know the type of thing. So you know um, if you're are they using Clavio? Hard to tell. Um, but the point is, this one you could have easily just cut off this image and then used the yellow as a background if you're using Clavio. And then still had this on plain text. It's, this is, doesn't look like a super duper specialized font anyway. If you wanted to maintain the um, the look and the style. Even for this one. You could have just like, cut off the um, the background. You know. It could just be me. Um, but I like the, the color that they used here. Because it's, you know, it, it pops up. Compared to this right here, you see. So in terms of design, I mean, I'm not scoring for accessibility or anything like that. That said, it's kind of, I'm surprised, or should I be, that this, this is all um, images. It's like an entire, the entire email is an image, but it looks beautiful. Okay, I like the hierarchy of this. Um, this is a little iffy that you know it's kind of blending in and it's the primary cta with that said i like this email i would give it a 1.5 um i like the design overall
Okay. I mean, you know, you can easily left align this. You can easily change the color type of thing. Otherwise, I think it's great. Copy 100% satisfaction. Let's look at the subject line. Motivation and focus. Guaranteed. Picture your, it picks your interest, right? You're curious. I'm like, guaranteed? You're going to guarantee it. You're going to guarantee that I'm going to be motivated and focused. It's, that's a pretty big um, <laughs> the guarantee. So 100% satisfaction or your money back. So, you know, if you've seen some of my videos where I talk about that subject line is your promise and when I open it, I better see that. And it does, it, there has to be a continuation, continuation. It has to be cohesive, right? So now I'm seeing motivation and focus guaranteed, 100% satisfaction or your money back. You know, they're not verbatim, but it kind of answers that. It's like guaranteed, you're going to guarantee this. And then I open them like 100% satisfaction or my money back. Oh, all right. That's cool, right? Uh, that's interesting. Actually, let me just put the, the two here. Um, so I like that. I like that in the copy, that the subject line um, in the the hero copy answers the subject line right there. No, you know, no bait and switch. So, and they explain it further within 30 days of your first purchase. If you're at 100% satisfied with the results of Magic Mind, we'll reimburse you for your entire question, for your entire order no questions asked i like that it took away all the risk right i'm like order this if you don't want it no questions asked i do want to know do i need to send the battles back <laughs> right <laughs> uh, motivation and focus guaranteed you know they really get into it with 655 reviews and more rolling in every day you can really say that magic rights approved from for increased motivation and focus or attention span that combined with a 100 percent money back guarantee Makes it as much of a sure thing as you'll ever find. I like that they're very specific of how many reviews they have. 655 reviews. That honestly doesn't see much. But still, they, they were very specific, right? Um, I like that. Cool. Learn where testimonies connect. Okay. Where is learn more going? Aha. Magic meets science. Interesting. We'll take a look at this later, but okay. I like the copy. The copy's great. Try Magic Mind today. Try Magic Mind today. Um, I like this copy. It's clear. Um, it's focused. It's, you know, it's, they fulfill their promise that they're going to talk about the motivation and the focus and the guarantee. So, you know. Right. I like that they talk a little bit. I wish they talked a little bit more about how this is good, but actually it's, you know, it's a proven formula. So they did address this. There's a two for me, a two in my book. I like that. CTA, try magic mind today. Try magic mind today. They're asking me to do one thing. And then even in the footer, they have other things here because you know that this pops up more and this is more of, I wish this was, this was smaller, but still. Um, this is more subdued. It's darker, right? But it's not highlighted, but this is like, it's a pop. Like if I'm looking at the screen, you know, I'm looking at this cute ombre pink peach button, right? Here, not so much, but that's a design thing. But in terms of the focus and asking me to do one thing, which is to try Magic Mind today, that's a two. So a two in my book, right? And you know, I get $30 off. I should really get this again. <laughs> cohesive branding so we're gonna move my screen a bit here so we can take a look at their website okay i like that this changes if you hover away it says are you still there right see if i hover away i mean cool so it's the world's is this the um the home page okay the world's first productivity shot um the colors are there the logo is there so you right the colors um, each shot contains a magical combination of 12 ingredients. So the copy, the way they, they speak, right? Um, I call it business casual, which is a little bit of personality, right? Um, natural sweet taste they find in pyramids. Pyramids. Um, I like this thing right here. But um, branding-wise, in terms of the look, in terms of the copy and the colors, right? Um, it's pretty consistent. 
and then they have the reviews there, judge.me reviews. So they have 660 reviews, right? Aha. Uh -huh. 660 reviews and 488 of them is five out of five, 92 is three. Okay. okay. So five people reviewed again. Well, that's a stretch now because, <laughs> you know, about 50, 60, 70 people didn't really quite agree there. They're kind of like in the middle down, but I'm nitpicking, right? So um, in terms of branding, I give it a two. Cool. Um, and then unsubscribe, it's right there. You know, longer will receive the email. It's clear. Unsubscribe. You click here. Are they using? Let me see just to see if they're using Clavio. They are. Okay. So they are using Clavio. Um, so in this sense, it's, it's a 2. So because the design is 1.5, they're actually a 9.5. This is a 9.5 email. It's a 9.5 because it has all the elements that I need. It's well designed. Right, it has a clear hierarchy. Um, the copy is great. It the subject line, um, the focus on the subject line and the copy is very tight. They're just like talking about one thing, which is you know um, essentially try it. There's a guarantee you're not gonna lose. Right, um, they have that. Uh, it's very clear. CTA asking me to do one thing. Great. Um, branding on point. If you look at their Instagram too, the colors are there, right? I like that. It's it's continuous. You know, like you build trust when you do that. If your Instagram, your website, your emails, and your presence um, across the board online is consistent, it builds trust, and you kind of you do build that um, branding in the mind of people and they you build some certain expectations but at the end of the day it's just the the trust is there cool and you know and subscribe it's a big uh compliance wise they have their address and everything that the only thing really is that this email is just one entire picture and it totally threw me off um it has you know, if you turn off, the, oh, I can't turn off the images again, but you know, it's just, you're going to miss out if you have a good portion of your people who don't have that on. But at the same time, you know, not only do you want that for accessibility, if I don't know how they are in terms of inbox placement, but having all this copy, great copy, um, and you know, your inbox can't really read it. <laughs> they, they, they can't tell what you're writing in there. Um, it could help if you put plain text in, in your in your emails, right? It could help with the placement. Um, it's one thing to, um, to to test out for your brand, yeah. And I think that's pretty much it. Um, that's pretty quick. And I um, hope you enjoyed this. Hope you you learned some good stuff today. And I'll see you again tomorrow. Thank you. Bye bye.